Hi everybody, this is Sonia. Welcome back. Um, this channel is Cat Crazy Creations. Um, I am here to do my crafty goals for 2020 or 2020. Uh, let's go ahead and get started. The first one, I have my notes down here. The first that I want to talk about is crochet. Um, I want to finish. I'm going to do things a little different this year. I'm not going to say what I'm going to make. Um, but I'm just going to say how many of what I'm going to make. And so I'm going to finish two crochet projects a month. And that would total 24 projects in 2020. So I think that's very doable. Um, I don't see a problem with being able to accomplish that. Okay, and for my cross stitch, I'm going to continue with my current rotation of four projects. Um, on Sunday, I only work on a project one day, and it is a small or a mini sized project. And Sunday is only a one day. Um, and then, let me see, Monday and Tuesday, I do a bigger project, maybe like five by seven or a little bit bigger of a size for two days for Monday and Tuesday. Uh, Wednesday and Thursday would be back down to a smaller size, like five by seven or smaller size. And then Friday and Saturday, I do a large. So my large pieces are on Monday and Tuesday and Friday and Saturday. And then I have my small pieces on Sunday and Wednesday and Thursday. So that is what I'm going to do. Um, so I'm just going to stick with that rotation all year. When I finish something, then I will start something new to replace it, just as I have did in the past. Um, I am going to do a new start as soon as I finish something. I'm going to start on Titanic. Um, my youngest son um, is very interested in Titanic and all of that and he had asked me if I would you know make him a Titanic picture and I know a lot of people do not like um, the Titanic the pictures because of the Black Ada and all of that so I'm well aware of that but I'm only going to be cross stitching like I said I do the cross stitching during the day so I will have daylight hours and I do have a lamp and so I'm hoping that it won't be too much of a struggle to work on it but he wants one and I'm gonna go ahead and do that for him um, and I will show um, the pattern or picture of it the fabric and floss and all of that when I get ready to start it um, I've just ordered the fabric it should be in today and then I will get everything else kitted up um, and I would still like to start I wanted to start on mother's tree last year but I'm still doing research I'm trying to see how far back I can go with the mothers and grandmothers and all of that before I actually get started but I'm hoping that this year will be the year that I can get mother's tree started um, okay scrapbooking I'm gonna do the same as I did as I wanted to do last year I'm going to I want to finish one scrapbook layout a month which will total 12 scrapbook layouts so that's still my goal that's still what I want to do um, now possible other crafts there are some new crafts that I want to try in 2020 but I'm not sure that I will be able to get to them. But they are something things that are interesting to me and that I have did them a long time ago in the past. 
So I just want to kind of try to bring them back and see how I feel about them now. Um, one of them being felt applique, especially the ornaments, the small, not really the stockings, but just like the small ornaments. And that's where they have the kits and they have the felt and then you applique on the little pieces, put stuffing behind them to make them more dimensional. Yeah, I used to do that all the time when my kids were, I don't know, toddlers, I think, just like maybe when they were like six months to two years old, something three years old. Yeah, and then the other thing that I'm interested in doing is plastic canvas. I used to do that all the time. And um, as cross stitch, as I started, you know, to do cross stitch, um, that kind of went by the wayside. But I'm really having an interest to try it again. So, like I said, these are just things I would like to do. So I don't know if I will get anything accomplished or not with those. And I want to do another art journal. Um, I, if you guys have followed me for a long period of time, you guys will know that I'd made one art journal. And that was just using um, pictures out of magazines. And I would um, have quotes or sayings or just something that inspired me. And I would um, use watercolor um, markers, anything like that. And I made an art journal. Um, so I want to do that. I want to try to do that again this year because it's been several years, probably three years or so probably since I made the first one. But I really like to do that. And with what happened last year with my mom and everything, I'm really feeling a desire to create another one this year. And then as far as non-crafty things go, I would like to, I will be doing, this is, I will be doing, um, updates on the feral cats. Um, there will be updates on George the parakeet. And I will do some updates on Oreo the kitten. So those will be happening. Um, and also I just, as far as my channel goes, I just... I'm trying desperately to reach 2,500 subscribers. I am so close. I think I'm 2,486 or something like that. So almost 2,500. I'm really trying to reach that goal. So please, you know, if you guys like the videos, then share them so that they can get out um, to other people and so... Because there are a lot of people that might not even, you know, know about, you know, me or my channel or anything like that. And that just helps me get out into, um, you know, YouTube land out there so that other people can see. So that would be a big, big help. And um, I did not do a giveaway last year in July. I was going to do a big giveaway um, for both the crochet and cross stitch, but my mom's health declined, so I wasn't able to do that. So I'm planning this year to do a video. To, this year will be 11 years on YouTube. So I want to, yeah, 11. I've been on here for so long that I, <laughs> I think it's, uh, I think it's 11 years. So, yeah, I want to do a giveaway because you guys are awesome. You guys have stuck with me through everything, and I want to give back and show my appreciation. So, anyway, I think that is it for the goals. Yeah, I think that is it. So, anyway, um... Thank you guys so much for watching, for continuing to um, stick with me, be a part of my channel, for all your encouragement, for all the comments. I love them. Um, that is another goal this year. 
with my mom's health, I really slacked off on the um, commenting back. That was very, very important to me, and it still is. And I'm going to get back into doing that this starting this month, January. I'm going to start commenting back on comments. So anyway, um, thank you guys all so much. You've made these going on here 11 years so much fun. And that's why I just keep doing it. I'm really enjoying all of this with you guys. So anyway, um, take care. And I will see you guys on my next video. Take care.